Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Salami and we're back with another video. And today I'm gonna show you how you can play League of Legends on your Steam Deck. Let's get into it. Hey guys, welcome back. We are going to start our journey into putting League of Legends on your Steam Deck. First step, you've probably already done, but this is an all-encompassing um, video. So first thing you're gonna wanna do is sorry for the wobble. Uh, is you're gonna want to go to the live bit, the storefront, major first step, and you're gonna want to search for Proton. A couple of things here. You're looking for these two. You're looking for the Battle Eye runtime and the Anti Easy Cheap. Now, uh, you should have these anyway if you're playing any kind of multiplayer games on your Steam Deck. But you definitely are gonna need these now. Uh, so make sure you've got those in your library and that's basically everything from within the Steam Deck. Uh, that's, I know, right? Easy. So what you want to do now is you want to push your Steam button. Uh, you're going to want to head down to power and you're going to want to go over to switch to desktop. That's the next major step. Go into discover, which is this icon down the bottom here. Uh, and you want to look for, you're going to search up a app. And to do that, you hold Steam and X, which will bring up your keyboard. And from here, you're looking up for an app called Lucris. L-U, we'll see if it actually comes up, Lucris. I don't know whether it's gonna come up. Uh, is it gonna come up if I just put L-U? Yes. L-U will get you to what you need, which is this video game preservation platform. Um, I'm assuming there's other ways of putting League of Legends on your Steam Deck, but for me, this was the cleanest, easiest option out of all of them, okay? So once you're here, you just want to download this, install Lutris. Um, and this shouldn't take too long. Hey guys, welcome back. Once we've got Lutris installed, what you want to go is you want to go to it, the app itself. It'll come under games and you can just click on it from there. And from here, you're going to load in. Now you can see I've been using this before, um, but don't worry about that too much. Uh, so next up, what you're going to do is you're going to click on the plus here, and you're going to search for a game. Uh, and this is going to search through the website for it. So you want to put in League. Now there's another app here. I don't know what this one does. I've had to try it and it didn't work. So I just left that and um, I just went for this one here. This one seems to be the one you want. Um, and then you want to find the correct one for you. So you want to find the right region, right? So for me, I need the oceanic region, but if you're in America, I think you just go for the base one at the top standard. Uh, you have to let me know, but they've got different ones there, like BR, EU, W, KR, Korean, Oceanic. So I've got to download the oceanic one because that's my zone. Um, and then you tell it to create a shortcut, and then you go install. Now, there's a few things to this. You might hear a bell, it's my cat running around. Uh, you continue, and it'll sort out all the bits and bobs it needs to do to get this thing running. Oh my goodness, what are you doing, honey bunny? Cats, man, I'll tell you, they are uh, non-stop animals of destruction. I've learnt that very quickly over the last few months. Um, so it's going to go through and run all this. I may speed this up um, if you guys don't want to know. Uh, so this will pop up. You want to go install. Now there is a, not a trick, it does say in this, it says do not log in during installation. Um, just close the installation client once it finishes downloading, okay? Um, and you'll know when you want it wants you to install because it'll pop up. So it may, it's not hanging as per se, you've got the little circle spinning around, but this does take a wee bit of time. And see, this is what it's saying about do not sign in here. Um, just let it install without any cause of, uh, without signing in. Because if you sign in, you basically break the install um, without question. Uh, my first time doing this, I got way too excited and I broke the installation and had to start again. So do not 
I repeat, <laughs> do not log in when this is installing. Um, this shouldn't take too much longer. As you can see, it's winding around pretty quick. Uh, so tell me, what's your favorite hero in League of Legends? Are you going to play League on your... I assume you're watching this because you want to play League on here. Um, what are your thoughts? What are you going to be playing? Are you going to try ranked? Are you not going to try ranked? I would not recommend it. But if that's something you want to do, you can do it. So, so now that's finished, you just want to quit out. And this will um, continue doing its thing. And it, it realizes that it's downloaded and now it's installing the game data and it will pop up in the background there and it'll do what it needs to do. So this is like installation complete. This is how easy it is to install League of Legends. Um, but funnily enough, looking online, like it was really awkward. Now we do not have any pictures. So League will just be a, a blank file. Um, so you can, when you add this, so I'm gonna add this to uh, add to Steam, so you don't have to come to the desktop to play. Um, you can go online and get the correct sized banners and portraits, which I'm going to go do now, and then I will come back to you and tell you uh, the best way to do that. Hey guys, um, doing some research, there's a web website called Steam Grid DB. And they have all sorts of icons that you may want to use for your um, unofficial games that aren't part of League. So I've already downloaded some, as you can see down the bottom, and I've just called them Icon, Banner, and Home. So they all have the right sizes. And so once you've done that, you can quit out of here and out of whatever you're using for your um, internet. Uh, and you want to go into Steam, but not, uh, not gaming mode Steam. You just want to go into the standard client of uh, Steam. Uh, and you're going to want to go to your library. Okay. Uh, and you're going to go down to League of Legends here that I've just installed. And as you can see, it's got no pictures or icons. And what you want to do is go manage. And you're going to want to go down to properties. And from here, you can set your shortcuts and pictures. So we're going to go looking and it's in home. Uh, and then we want to go to downloads and icon that is now that done it's a good start uh, so that's where the icon is done so that's one down okay and then from there we can click on here and go set custom background uh, and we want to do the same again so we want to go out of here and we want to go to the home deck and then we want to go down to downloads and then we want to go to banner. There we are. So we've got our banner and our logo. And the last thing we need to do is our, our home. And you want to search for League of Legends. So you want to go to, you just need to find it. So here it is here. And you want to right click on it and you want to go manage and set custom artwork. And from here, you can go back, go to home deck, and then down to download the wherever you've stored your picture. And then for me, I go for home, which is this one here. Done. Okay. So there is a couple of steps to getting your artwork on done. Like you actually have to scroll through the um, your game library to get to this point okay so once you're done here you can go back into gaming mode once you're back here you want to go to your library uh, and then your non steam which I'm already on and then you want to load it up hey guys welcome back and before you load it up before you load it up I would recommend you download my controller scheme um, I have another video which I will put in the comments below. If you want to download King, Kala King Salami's League of Legends layout, um, I think it's pretty good. Um, so yeah, download that, and then you can load up the game. And it should just work. Should. Let's do this live together and hope I don't come out looking like an idiot, shall I? So you can sign in now. 
I won't I won't make you go through the pain of watching me sign in and I will be back. Before I move on, I must say one thing. If you've downloaded my control scheme before you log in like I just have, I've just realized I've it, it's already rebound the keys. So to click on to the things here, you need to push the left bumper to click is your left click right and also make sure you click stay signed in because otherwise you're going to have issues later down the line okay sweet it will then once you're logged in you can just click on play which will be left click um and it, it you know it's working correctly when you get this uh, strange outline around the league of legends thing um usually that's a sign that it's working um and usually i would turn off all the animated backgrounds and that to save on performance on these initial loads um but that's up to you like i've just left it on to show you that you don't need to um, and it should load up just fine as you can see it's all going through quite swimmingly actually which makes me very happy indeed and i'm i'm really grateful for you guys being here you've probably clicked off by now let me know in the comments below if you're still here listening to me ramble on and burp um so one small thing with these updates they do take a while on steam deck i've noticed compared to pc um and they sometimes have a tendency to hang at like 99 percent um let it hang for a while like give it 20 minutes and if it still hasn't loaded just quit out reload the game it'll repair and usually work straight away um so just keep that in mind like the game will work it just sometimes on these initial downloads it will have issues see that's going to take about seven minutes um so once this is down done downloading uh we'll come back for one final test to make sure i've got it all working and see them uh, in game uh and you're going to get this too from time to time this is what i'm talking about while it's updating you're going to get these like random disconnects that's actually quite good that that's popped up but if you leave it it will reconnect and it will work fine. Um, this just seems to happen. Again, we are hack not hacking the game to work on SteamOS, but it's not native to this Windows uh, operating system, so it is going to have issues. But see, there we go. It's back. Um, and that doesn't happen in game too often. I've never had it actually disconnect during a game. So, and I can say that with certainty. Uh, I do have one issue in game and it doesn't, again, it's not something I can replicate because it does happen very irregularly, which is the screen will start juttering whenever you move the mouse. Um, I haven't tried quitting the game and reloading. I think that might be something worth trying. And if you do do this and you start having um, a jittering camera, and you do quit out and reconnect to the game. Can you tell me if that fixes the issue? Um, it doesn't happen every game. It might happen every second or third or fourth game. But every now and again, I'll get screen jittering uh, for no apparent reason. And I'm not too sure uh, how to fix it. There we go. The update's done. And we're good to go. So again, I'm not going to hop into a live game because uh, no. Uh, but we can go into practice mode. and get into it we'll add a bot for fun and we'll start a game and we'll just go garen because he's just a solid pick i'm not too worried about setting this up correctly um, what's your favorite champion in league let me know as i continue to ramble and this video will not get the views it deserves real quick okay here we are as you can see, we're, we're un uncapped here. We're at 180 frames per second. We are rocketing. So you could leave it uncapped if you wanted. I don't see why not. We might as well leave it uncapped. Uh, let's go, here we go, video. Yeah, you do it in game. So it comes to the right resolution in game, which is nice. And then you can, of course, change your quality. We will we'll max this all out very high. And how hard does that affect frame rate? Ooh, no, not too bad. There we go. And of course, you could change whatever you wanted. So, yeah, there's League of Legends on the Steam Deck. Uh, and like I say, I have another video, just look for it. And it shows you how I'm using this control scheme and uh, how to play. All right, guys, thanks for this. Uh, have a great day and I'll catch you in the next one.